Hey! Hello? Your money or your life? Well, I work as an apprentice of a mage who overloads me with the work and set unrealistic deadlines. Believe me, you don't want my life. What? It's a figure of speech. I want your money. I know I'm just whining since you're robbing me anyway. Take it. I have nothing more. What is that? A copper? A copper? What can I buy on it? Dinner. Dinner? So I'm sitting behind that tree for two days now, not counting you, the only person I've seen so far was some night, and after I jumped out of the bushes to rob him, it was him who robbed me. And all I have now is dinner. No, you don't. Unless you eat copper, but you can't buy dinner on that. If you don't want that, I can give it back. What's on your back? On my... On your back? I think it's none of your concern. It is my concern. No. Yes. Show it. Man, do you remember I said I work for a mage? The thing on my back is a magical stuff. Magical what? Stuff. It spits spells. But it's not working correctly, it's cursed. Actually, I came to the forest to bury it. So you had a stuff on your back and you didn't use it against me? I said it's cursed. Who is that superstitions? Give it to me, I'll find some use for it. Okay, let's have a deal. I'll give you the stuff and you'll give me the club. Exchange. Agree. On one, two, three. Cool. Now give it back. What? I didn't say one thing. The curse is not the only problem. You have to be a wizard to use this stuff. And you are not. And I have a club. So give it to me. You are fooling me. I'm not fooling you. You have to have magic abilities and to train a lot unless you are very gifted. Maybe I am gifted because I feel something. To use it without preparation you need to be literally a chosen one. And even in that case it is cursed and it will act against you. Now give it to me. I'll leave you with a copper. Let's say I bought this club and the stuff wouldn't get into anyone's evil hands. No, I think I'll give you something very different. It won't- Whoa! He was a chosen one.